What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here and today we have the Super Smash Brothers Nintendo Direct on November 1st. This is going to be the last one. Now that makes it even crazier that I haven't streamed this one, but the reactions will still be the same. I'm going to be recording this, as you can see, due to the um, crazy shit that happened last week. But that whole, <laughs> that, that, that was that, that was a trip. But anyways, I'm not going to be able to stream this one right away. I, I, I'm setting my stuff up on Plex Storm, so that should be where everything goes down. But um, I'll keep you guys informed. If you're not following me on Twitter, by the way, if you want to keep up with everything that I'm doing, live streams, whenever they go down then Twitter's the place to follow me because I'm going to be able to stream on a platform where we don't got to worry about like nudity or other shit getting us shut down or whatever. So if we, if we do some fucked up shit, technically speaking, we won't get in trouble, which is kind of like the liberation I'm sort of aiming for with this whole political protest against YouTube type. But, well, I mean, it's not really all that serious. Well, anyways, fuck it. We're, we're talking way too much about that. We need to focus on the topic at hand. This Nintendo Direct, it was scheduled for super early this morning on a weekday. Who the fuck is going to be awake to watch this thing, Nintendo? I mean, or at least in the position to watch this thing. People got school. People got work. What the fuck is you doing out here? I mean, I know I got shit to do. I was supposed to be sleeping. <laughs> I was supposed to be sleeping in. Last night was Halloween night. Even though it was a Wednesday, I mean, not really much is supposed to go down on a Wednesday. I mean, you know, on, on that kind of a day, you don't really party. But I tried to do at least a little something to get into the Halloween mood. Went to Times Square. Was chilling with a friend. But I mean, we didn't really do much. You know, there's not really much out there on a weekday, even if it is a Halloween. But it's whatever. The point is, is that now we are ready for this. I got into the crib literally 10 minutes ago trying to set all this up. To be honest with you, I probably could have had it set up if I focused on it. But the problem is that I didn't um, give myself enough time. If I maybe come home like maybe a few minutes earlier than maybe I would have been able to, but maybe if I was like home 30 minutes earlier than I would have been able to, but it's all good, man. Here we fucking go. It's about time, man. What in God's name is about to be revealed in this game? What are they about to reveal, bro? What are they about to reveal? Why, are all these characters? Okay. Okay. I still, yo, K. Root. Oh, oh, final cement. Oh, bro. What character? Yo, Goku. Goku! 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 Hello, this is Masahiro Sakurai from Sora Limited. Let's go! Yo, Sakurai looks good here! Before the launch of Super the Smash final Bros. direct! Bro, one so month! So far, we've confirmed 72 fighters. 74 if you count Pokemon Trainer as 3. Our entire Bro. team has worked really hard. This is it! This is the final destination right here. With this Nintendo Direct, we'll have revealed every fighter you can find in the game. Yo, okay, that's it? Let's do this. Goku! 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 I'm wearing the shirt! I'm wearing the shirt! Penny boys! Oh, it's time! Who is this? Shadows! Yo, 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 yo. There's gotta be multiple characters here, bro. Who the fuck? Oh, punch out, nigga! How he hit Simon Belmont like that? Yo, son! Simon, get that nigga! Get him out of there! Oh, Ken. Okay, so the leaks are real. Fuck. Nigga, fuck the leaks were real. Okay, so they got the, they got the clone. All right. Damn, I, I feel like I feel like ass because we all saw the leaks, bro. I mean, we, we figured as much it was going to be legit. Ken is a great character, man. I mean, plus the alternatives that they could throw in there. It's going to properly represent the shit out of him. And he's still a clone. Like, that's so good. This nigga. Ken Masters in this bitch. Yo. Hit that nigga. Man, they got no protect. I can't do nothing against that. What? 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 Who that? Who that? Who's that? Shadow? Yo! Son of a pup! Oh shit! Nigga, fuck! All right. That's right. Shadow! 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 Who is this? Huh? Yo, Incineroar? Okay, okay, no, okay. More leaks, more leaks, baby. He's okay, okay. I'm, I'm ready for it. It's not a surprise. Th these Dude, things aren't surprises at this point. With fire, huh? But it's dope. <laughs> Who's voice actor is that? Yo, let's go. What kind of move? Yo, he throws niggas on ropes. Yo, the drop. What the fuck? The nigga hits us. He hits the suplex. Oh, dumb nigga. He about to drop the whole... Huh? I don't get the reference. Oh, this nigga's using the same move that he does in Sun and Moon. Wait, no, no, he doesn't. What the fuck was that? He hit the nigga. He hit him with the one. He hit him with the fucking down scene special. How you took out Ken? 
Alright, so Lil Mac is dead. Ken is dead. How many characters are they gonna kill here? Damn, everybody's got the gloves on. They're ready to take this nigga down, bro. Incineroar looks really good, by the way. Just saying. Is that everybody? Is that really everybody, bro? Come on, Shadow's gotta be in that bitch. There's gotta be one more, bro. At least Goku! Oh, no, no, it's not over yet. It's not over yet! There's a reason why he's not showing Hailing more! from the Street Fighter series, Ryu's rival Ken joins as an Echo Fighter. Bro, let's go! In his original game, Ken could be considered Ryu's Echo Fighter. Though perhaps you could say Luigi is the original Echo Fighter. But let's get back to Damn, Ken. bro. That's like... Ken has been distinguished from Ryu over the years, but the Ken you see this time is based on Super Street Fighter 2 Turbo. Here's how he'll differ from Ryu. Bro. His heavy Shoryuken turns up the heat. Okay, okay. The shape of his Hadouken is different too. And his Tatsumaki Senpu Kyaku strikes multiple opponents hits? multiple times. Okay. Hell Are those wheel. the same elements in the game? I don't fucking remember. Focus attack. Right now is not the time to ask me. We've included lots of Ken's signature moves, such as his famous kicks, which change based on your command inputs. He's a bit faster than Ryu, and we've also incorporated other tweaks from recent titles. Hey. Just like Ryu, he has two, two oh, okay, final okay. smashes. I was about to say. But I mean, it doesn't really matter. Spinning uppercut Who's gonna use Ryu this? Ken. We've made it look flashy, as it is in the Versus series. Woo Damn, nigga! Execute a final Bro. smash near an opponent, and you'll instead perform a Shippu Jin Raigek. Bro! Hits niggas with the Street Fighter 4 special! Excuse me, or is it 5? I don't fucking remember. Now for our last Incineroar, new though. challenger, Incineroar. The last new challenger. It may Man, be a Pokemon, it. but it mainly uses pro wrestling moves. And as it's still such, good though. its throws are a bit more powerful. Powerful throws. Like a true pro wrestler, when one of its attacks is successful, it'll pose for the audience. He poses? Luckily, you can cancel out of these poses at oh, any time, so they won't really? open you up to additional enemy attacks. Okay, that's kind its of a cool touch. Its neutral special is called Darkest Lariat. It was Incineroar's signature move in the Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon games. Perhaps it's something of a red cyclone. Its up special is Cross Chop. Did he really say that? You'll leap up and come rocketing back down. Bro, is... This attack can be very effective, but if you mess Don't up, you get it's easy to self-destruct, so oh. be careful. For its side special, this is cross top miss all the time. Opponents run the ropes after a dashing grab. He throws niggas into the ropes! Away, press the button at just the right moment. If you're too early, you'll do a back body drop. Wait too long and you'll fail. Nail the timing and you'll pull off a powerful lariat. Yo, Incineroar is on some it's down Kirby grapple revenge. mode shit. When damaged, Incineroar's burning passion comes to the surface, powering up its next attack. What? That's Incineroar's idea of a counterattack. Yo. In its final smash, Max Malicious Moonsault. It's even faster and fiercer than the Z-move it's based on. Bro, Dude, that's it, bro. We they got everybody. All of the no, uh, uh, go, cool. go, 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 go. But it is the same amount as the original Nintendo 64 game. And once you've unlocked them all, there's gotta be more, bro. This is stupid. It'll look like this. Jesus hard Christ! To guess where each one's located. But That's they're sorted by one, two, three, four, in the order they joined the seven. series. That's I hope you'll enjoy hell, battling man. with all 74 fighters on the roster. Wow, bro. What a game. Red, red. Yo, these are me, bro, looking sick. We've seen them already, but I mean, they look clean as fuck. They the detail in these things is always impressive, man. My nigga, Wolf, bro. Nut sacks intact. Yeah, boy. Wait a minute, this music sounds familiar. Isn't that a, a Splatoon song? You may recall yeah, King that we're K. creating Amiibo in parallel with the game. Oh, available in Here's a look available at new Amiibo figures. Damn, all right, all right. These are looking clean. If they even put, put the old characters, the Pichu and the Young Link, they don't even give a fuck. We determined that collectible trophies wouldn't be a great fit for this game. No Honestly, more? They were really difficult to develop, too. Wow, they got rid of that them all. That said, the Super Smash Brothers series yeah, is one it's massive okay, crossover at heart. To be honest with you, I mean, the trophies were more. nice. A way to enjoy characters other than fighters, 
huh? variety of video game worlds. What? What? Character customization? Is what we came up with. They're what? Spirits. Okay, people were right. They guessed this mode really right. And I don't mean the spooky kind. What the fuck? They to guessed it? Simply, these spirit characters spirits. will lend a helping hand to your fighters, powering them up in battle. What kind of blade and dry- Wait! Pyramithra! No! No! In the no! Super Smash Brothers series, Rex! the characters are toys no. in the real world, but they are fighters in the world of the imagination. Oh god, Returning wait, to the Mithra. real world is an ongoing theme. In the imagination, you can battle impossible combinations of characters. Is he confirming the lore? In this mysterious world, the unspeakable happens. Many beloved characters lose their physical forms. Yo, this is a story oh, mode! Except the fighters are turned into spirits, unable to return to the real world. Tails? This is a spirit. Fighters can join forces with spirits to enhance their powers. Yo. There's a massive amount of wild Dragonite spirits. Bro, so th so they're not doing the trophies, they're doing this. There are several classes of spirits. Hinoka? Standard spirits are dubbed novices. Stronger ones. I don't know if this title is advanced. I don't know if you're gonna play this. Strong ones <laughs> but it looks dope. Aces, and some are in a league of their own. Legend. Bro, what is Sakurai trying to do with this? One primary spirit can be assigned at a time. A primary spirit's power will be added to the fighter who has it equipped. So they come with stats that the spirits like power up on their own? In some cases, That's these what augmented like. fighters become extremely powerful. Damn, Articuno, Zapdos, and Moltres. If a primary they spirit got all has enough it. available slots, you can assign them support spirits. Yo! They got the fucking uh, power. They must have power from Uprising. fighter stats, support spirits yeah. lend them additional skills. The Chaos King? Once the primary spirit and support spirits are set, your fighters all powered up. The what main the way to acquire this? spirits is to win spirit battles. Spirit battles, here we go. You'll find a variety of spirits lined up on the spirit board. Choose the one you want to battle for. When you do, you'll face off against a fighter whose abilities and personality are kinda sorta similar to the opposing spirit. Oh, oh, okay. In the case of the Lakitu and Spiny spirit, you'll battle against Iggy Koopa and a group of small red Bowsers. Iggy's riding Oh, his the little niggas that he throws points. out. Oh, that's clever. Here are some examples that's of other battles. That's clever. Ha ha ha. Okay. Oh, because he uses it. Wait, wait, you don't. Oh, wow, Sakurai really. Wow, so they made it so you just literally don't see DDD. Giant guts. Oh, oh, okay, so just because. That's so cute. It looks so ridiculous, but I, I can honestly see myself like having fun with it. So he's emulating like the characters themselves. The enemy loves to taunt. Wow, really? My aching blood! The imprisoned, the nigga from Skyward. Oh shit! Oh, Gira, oh, that nigga, oh, okay, okay. Bro, that was one disturbing ass boss from that game. I I'll tell you that much. I didn't play it, I watched the whole game though, and it was like, man, fuck that. That's what Ganondorf originally is? What the fuck? Who is he? Oh, he playing as a me? This looks so silly. I mean, but it, 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 you can see the work that Sakurai put into it, so of course you're gonna appreciate it anyways. Wow, really? You fight the. This just looks ridiculous. So which one is gonna be Goku? If you're gonna emulate a Goku spirit. I don't know who the fuck that is. A Dr. Dodge is protected by a giant rock. He's, he's referencing a bunch of stuff. There's something for everybody in here. The bullet Bill? Captain Falcon. Oh, so you literally... They're incorporating like this. This mode, this, this ain't no story mode. This ain't no goddamn um, subspace emissary. This is some crazy ass goddamn challenge mode or whatever. Although it's not like that. Hit the puppet fighter to acquire the spirit within. What is going on in this mode? There's so much activity, bro. Even if you accidentally hit the shield, 
The damage will carry over, so you'll have an advantage the next time you encounter that spirit. Primary spirits have strength based on their type. Attack is strong against grab, grab is strong against shield, and shield is strong against attack. It's important to pick a spirit that has an advantage over your opponent. When you encounter traps like poison floors and slumber floors, be sure to prep yourself with an appropriate support spirit. Battle conditions offer hints before battle, so make sure to read them and form the right strategy. Okay. I don't know if I'm going to be playing too much of this. I mean, it looks crazy. With spirits on your side, there are all kinds of things you can do. I gotta see more, bro. When you fight with a primary spirit equipped, it'll level up after battle. Damn, I was hoping that or he was going to put the feed it um, smash run. Some spirits even have an enhanced form you can only unlock by leveling them up. Whoa! You can also send spirits Extra. back to the real world. While you do have to say goodbye to that particular spirit, its core will stay. And, by combining these cores, you can summon a new spirit. What? Bro, this is like... You can also he made train a fucking... spirits at dojos and the gym. This nigga Sakurai, he made or a goddamn them off a gotcha game of out of Smash Brothers. Which they'll bring back to you. He made a these gotcha game out of Smash. unlikely teams of characters, but each team could be somebody's dream come true. Wow. Training and exploring continues to yield results, even while playing other modes, or after turning off the game. So if you send out your spirits, just let them do their thing. But he kind of made this for um, Smash Brothers really well, because you know, you're gonna have Certain it on the goddamn spirits Switch. are known you as take masters. You can beat them to unlock facilities. Yo, Spike! What up, bro? Spirits can also be used to power up amiibo figure players. He made a gotcha game out of Smash Brothers, bro. You must bid them Grand farewell, Blue but you can repeat the process multiple times. Fire Emblem Heroes looking ass nigga. It's one great big collection hey. of characters from many different series, but just how many would you guess there are? Whenever you fight against the spirit, the final smash meter is enabled. Some spirits even help you fill up your gauge at a faster rate. Yo, they just trample you? Another way to put it, the spirit system lets you simulate battles between characters from more series than ever before. You can, you can simulate them, yeah. many unbelievable combinations and situations. That's cute. He really went for, he really went to try to like make it feel like you had everyone The power in this game. of enemy and ally spirit teams is displayed here. Bro, even metal faces in this bitch. Of course, stronger spirit teams make it easier to defeat weaker spirits. The more your power overshadows theirs, the less you'll be rewarded. It pays to have a fair fight. I love assembling I a team. Press the Y button for a recommendation that has a type advantage against the opposing spirit team. The game will recommend support spirits who can help out with certain conditions. Keep that in mind. You can also fight against other players who are using spirits. Hey. Given the way spirit types interact in battle, think carefully when building your team. Or balance your strengths in a two-on-two -two battle. But you know, you're still gonna play the game according to if you're nice at Smash or not. Like, if you're really good with a character, you're gonna be someone's ass if they're The not. game lets you battle together with friends via local wireless, or hey. take the fight to the world with online play. And I hope that online play is solid. To connect to Nintendo Switch consoles, press the DR button to pull up the okay. dashboard and select local wireless. Online! We've been waiting for this! There's no longer we need, to... need to separate the online modes into for fun and for glory. What? Instead, matchmaking is based on three factors. Excuse me? The straight up matchmaking? For online battles, you can set your preferred rules. Nice, nice. These you rules just jump can straight be in. Registered, so you can quickly select your favorite playstyle. Thank you. Before battle, Very one player's preferred rules will be chosen at random, and all players will fight using those rules. You can also choose not to set any preferred rules and let the others decide instead. If possible, the matchmaking system will find players with similar preferences and link them up for a battle. Global Smash Power is right, being practiced in concept again. but it's still used go. as an online leaderboard as well. 
A high GSP score, such as 100,000, means you've got more points than 99,999 other players. It's meant players. to make you feel like you have a huge day. Your GSP will change as the total population of players increases or you're overtaken. Oh, if shit. you're yearning for a challenge, try increasing your global smash power so that you'll naturally end up with some more serious opponents. So By it the really way, ranks every you can single set a player GSP in the score world. for each fighter. Fighters you haven't used yet will be assigned a placeholder GSP based on the highest score you've set with one of the other fighters. If you repeatedly self-destruct on purpose, you could face a penalty, like being disconnected. So please don't do that. Mm. <laughs> please do not do that! As with any multiplayer game, a stable connection is very important. Yes, please. For this Tell reason, us you got the something. matchmaking system will prioritize shorter distances between players. So will even if help? you set your preferred rules, please understand that we can't promise you'll always be matched accordingly. Okay. As such, so we'd appreciate try. it if you could make your connection as stable as possible. A wired LAN cable is recommended. Man, we ain't got no servers or nothing. We've bro. prepared a variety nothing. of other features for local wireless and online battles. Once your global smash elite power is high battles, enough, you can enter elite battles. So is this like the serious mode? When you reach this level, feel free to pat yourself on the back. You're good. Period. Whoa. After the game releases, we may adjust the game balance, and the team will definitely pay attention to the results of these elite battles. Yo, is it really gonna be that serious? It's like a like a X mode and Splatoon. Everyone who plays online needs their own smash tag. Oh, a smash tag. Nice. If only that was along the whole switch. You'll receive their smash tag. Friend codes. But it's not like you'll lose your smash tag even if you lose oh. a battle. You simply gain more tags as you win. Oh, it's just like... Try to collect lots oh. of smash tags. Oh, okay. So it's not even like a tag system where short your name. messages and send them before and after battles using the directional buttons. Hey. Freely choose from a wide selection of very... I can't answer my messages. own. You know, I'm gonna... I'd be like, fuck you, nigga. After you've chosen a fighter, you can enjoy other modes while you wait for the battle to begin. Not every mode will be available while matchmaking runs in the background, but you can leave and enter some game modes. That's good. Spectator you know, mode you, returns once something. again, so you can watch other players' battles. Nice. Maybe you can pick up some good tips that way. Man, this online mode looks like it's gonna be just Form as laggy as the other team and play together I'm not trying online to be negative, with a single Nintendo Switch system. You'll be paired up against two-player teams with the same setup. When you want to play online, you can create a special type of room to fight other players. If you set the rules for one of these battle arenas, you can fight against your friends. Here, there are spots where you can join the battle, wait in line, or even spectate. It all depends where you place your token. When you're in a hey, battle Smitty. arena, this should come in handy. No, the Switch Online app. Ah! The Switch Online app. You can voice chat oh. with others in battle arenas. It oh may shit! An essential tool for some players. They have total kind of brolic. We are also developing a free service for Super Smash Brothers Ultimate, and we're naming it Smash World. Whoa. Instead of focusing on stats like win-loss records, we're allowing players to post gameplay videos, watch them, and more. Once the service starts, we'll offer regular updates so you can post to your heart's content. So it's like a social media thing. Okay, maybe that, that's kind of interesting. Yo, Next, Shadow! I'd like to change topics and talk a no. little about assist trophies that assist will support your fighters in No! Shadow G confirmed! Oh. oh, well. It, it was nice to imagine. I wish they put Shadow in over Ken, to be real with you, bro. That's an echo. Wait, isn't this the girl from that series where, like, she gets to dress up as Samus and Zelda and shit? Oh, yeah, there we go. Beautiful. Play I never played this game, though, but this trophy is definitely a cool reference. I heard it's a cult classic. I heard this is a game that everybody fucks with. Isaac! Ah, uh, you tried, brother. He tried, man. Everybody got excited, bro. I thought it was possible too, man. It, it was definitely possible, but you know. Bro. This nigga ain't taking no damage. Didn't he like do something horrible to Ike or something? 
good job the Thwomp Oh my god! Okay. That was funny, I didn't see that coming. Dumbass. Springman! Give us an assist trophy, bro. I see him. Bro, Pyra, Mithra. Oh my god, I really thought Mithra was gonna be in this shit. Bro, no! Bro, Sakurai! I was really hopeful. But at least we didn't lose any of the mains. Oh, shit! Isabel, fuck. She's like, okay, nigga. You had enough. It's the flies and hand? It's just slapping, niggas? What the fuck? You get to control it? Who controls? Oh, no, the thing moves. This might get Yo, Tiki! The Cheeky Tiki! Bro, that is so dope. These are six trophies. This? Where the fuck you from? What kind of shit am I looking at? Tomatoes? Guile? Oh, shit! That's me in there! Bro! Sonic! Oh, you're at home. Okay, never mind! Hit that nigga! Hit him with the Sonic Boom! Wow. Okay, Akira from Virtual Mode? Bro, this nigga legit does the same fucking... That stupid-ass movement. They go all the way in with these trophies, man. You can tell they have a blast making them. The total number of assist trophies is now 59. Actually, Damn. they outnumber the Pokemon this time. What? Assist trophies who can be KO'd can also be defeated by the fighter who summoned them just before they're KO'd. That Why? way, you won't lose a point to the other player. Oh, so you could just... <laughs> just like the Ridley situation in now, Smash Now, I'd like to cover a variety of other features in the game. There's more? Oh. If you want he loves to showing us controls everything. or game modes, press the ZR button to open the dashboard and look in here. There are all kinds of helpful guides to check out. Century Smash may look familiar to veterans. It feels great uh -huh. to keep smashing enemies off the screen, doesn't it? Oh. You can play on many different stages. Multi-man melee! Just killing a bunch of niggas. In previous games, you had to unlock every fighter before playing All-Star mode. But now, you can play it right out of the box. Okay. The currently available fighters will appear endlessly. So that's it. Just, 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 just fight you can you save the replay data of your battles. And now, Did you, you see can the way they videos they, with it. They slam this nigga. Why Robin There's pissed? also a menu where you can read those quick tips and tricks you see during loading screens. When viewing them, you can sort by category or fighter. Mithra! To earn Mithra! This time, Mithra, each page please! Is sorted by category, and the layout looks more like a comic book. Press the button to check out each picture. Enjoy! The records menu tracks your battle history. There are five different options. You can view battle data separately Snake for light. offline and online play. Why? Is it? I gotta close. I gotta get close Trade up with Snake Smash doing that shit, bro. To score some in-game gold. I want to rewind, but I can't. Gold can be exchanged for music tracks, spirits, and items for spirits mode. If you're collecting music, I recommend visiting the shop to find the ones you want, instead of just relying on challenges. You can enter the options menu by pressing the ZR button to open the dashboard. This one game supports 11 languages. God damn. I know this is very important to some of you. For example, the voices of Pokemon are different in several languages. The fighter names are also really specific to everything. each language. What the fuck? These options were highly requested and well worth the effort. TV mode and handheld mode have separate settings for brightness and sound. 
They'll change automatically when you dock and undock, so be sure to set both. Okay. We've implemented a radar that displays the locations of all fighters. You can change its settings. It's funny, he's talking about this size. now. Oh, oh, never mind. Okay, you can change it. Oh, While you can just take that off. to wireless and online play, you can make your teammates semi-transparent so you don't get distracted. If you're fighting against a friend on the same system, you can adjust the strength of your fighters. Sometimes a player is just too good, and you want to take measures to ensure oh, it's a fair fight. If oh, that's, that's the good. case, try using this feature. When custom balance is adjusted, a symbol will be displayed. That's some bitch shit, of though. Course, Dude, you're too good. Turn your power down. Wireless and that's some dumb battle. shit. Who would really use that? I would be too... You I'd can be, customize my pride your fighters do that. and change their outfits. My pride would be In like, addition to the voice that. options, there are a variety of outfits to choose from. Speaking of Mii Fighters, let me introduce you to some new outfits we added in. Oh, the Yiga Clan! Let's go! Where the bananas at? Bro, why do you look built for? Oh, hey, the Splatoon 2 Inklings! Hey! I'll, now, this is the style that I was hoping they would have brought to as a costume for, you know, the actual Inklings. Ribbon Girl set too? Okay. These me costumes are hilariously adorable. They didn't put Geno in. R.I.P. to my nigga D1. Yo, you tried, bro. GB Robo! You found a snack! <laughs> Where's this nigga from? I forgot. Nintendo Labo Robot! You gotta be kidding me! No fucking way they put this nigga in there. They made an actual big ass robot. Wait, what? That must have just been like anyway, decoration There's something I should point out. As I said, Goku. we've revealed all of the fighters you can find in the game. DLC's coming, boys. But there are even oh, more coming post launch. Oh, yes! Oh yes! We've already implemented a huge roster of fighters. This oh, is yes! the Smash Brothers series, which means oh, yes! we're leaving the opportunity open to add in more fighters. Smash Ballot Part Two. Since we already included every fighter from the past games, that means there are no more fighters to include unless we develop new fighters from scratch. And we're not talking about Echo fighters. Yo, we'll be developing and selling sets that will include one fighter one stage, and multiple music tracks. The price for each set is expected to be $5.99. At the same time, we will offer the Fighters Pass. Okay, which we'll is... That's five fighters, five stages... Five niggas? They're tracks. putting five more niggas? Holy shit! February 2020? something like the Fighters Pass, ideally, we should reveal what's included before it becomes available for purchase. However, please allow us to offer this pass before we're ready to reveal its contents. Bro, of course! I hope only those who are confident in its value will purchase it. HELL YEAH! I'm gonna buy Once that again, bitch! The price Get is the... $24.99 for all five sets. Oh, oh lord. Now that we've finally what confirmed the development of this DLC, what please know that we'll be working really hard on it. Damn. I wonder if I'll ever get to take a break. By the way, here's one purchase bonus you'll get Sakurai. with the Fighters Pass. Sakurai! We gotta, we gotta cherish him! I almost- Sword Fighter outfit based on Rex from ah. Blade Chronicles 2. Damn we it, not even a myth to include when we started planning, so we couldn't add characters from titles like Xenoblade Chronicles 2. No, okay, at least you addressed planning it. Had started. I hope this outfit will help you feel like you're playing as Rex. Damn, we're also were they hearing ever? some music from the Xenoblade Chronicles series. Give it a listen and okay. go playing sometime. Damn Other it, yo! Xenoblade Chronicles Maybe characters Mithra's will coming. also appear as spirits. Hyra. Damn. We've yet to create any of the paid DLC, and we haven't locked down any release dates. But we'll start working on them as soon as we're finished with the main game. Bro. It may take Sakurai's around a year or so to finish releasing he's all the DLC. He's busting his ass out here! No, but, on a separate note, we're currently developing something. Something you'll get for free as a limited time offer. There's if you too buy much! The Super Smash Brothers Ultimate game now. There's too much. It isn't finished yet, but I want.
want to give you a special sneak peek. What? What? Dog, why does it feel like there's every second there's something new? Is this some sort of a story, bro? Wait, Mario? Why does Mario look so pissed for? Wait, don't tell me there's some Bowsette shit. Don't tell me they're about to put a crown on the nigga. What? PD Piranha? As a fighter? Who wanted this? What the fuck? Beat it down! He slept! What? Whoa! 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 Did, did you see the range? They had to put in another Mario. They don't give a fuck anymore. They don't give a fine fuck anymore! That's right. Piranha Plant will take root in what? Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. And not as an assist trophy, but as an actual fighter. Nigga, excuse can me? spit poison, fire off spiky balls, and perform long-range attacks. This Bro. tricky character is full of surprises. What is His going final smash on? is PD Piranha. If you get caught in the cage, well, let's just say it won't end well for you. Piranha Plant is scheduled for completion after the launch of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. They really put this character in We've gotten in the a game. little head start on it, but it probably won't be ready until a couple of months after launch. Please stay tuned. That is some Remember, wild Piranha shit. Piranha Plant is a free, limited time offer. How they put in Piranha Plant, but they didn't put in Waluigi! No gold point registration process to receive it. I hope you'll consider pre-ordering. A free fight? Oh, damn! We're okay. also creating an amiibo. Wow! It has a nice curved form to it. That's really, really pretty, actually. I, I, I like that one. It's got the DSLs on deck! Later today, you'll be able to pre-purchase the game after finishing this Nintendo Direct. Yo! Go to Nintendo eShop or Nintendo.com before you forget. Why would they put that nigga in the game? Over what? I have an announcement for everyone <laughs> watching this in North America. That's me. On our official site, you can find information for a variety of upcoming hands-on events. Participants will have a chance to try out all 74 fighters, so please check out the website to find Whoa, out where we'll show up next let's and more. Go. That's it for the last Nintendo Direct for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate before the game launches. And then there will be more after the game launches, right? So but I mean, before we go, yeah, it's not over yet. What the? I should mention that the adventure mode in this game is nothing like what we came up with for the subspace emissary. He wants to make sure that said, expectations are what created. exactly caused all these characters to lose their bodies and transform into spirits? That gotcha. I'll show you how it all begins and leave the rest to your imagination. There's some lore, okay, my nigga? Then, please look forward to the game's release. Bro, Sakurai is a god. He has blessed all of us once again. But I mean, don't let a single one get away. What? We're talking about the spirits thing, right? Is this a cutscene? Is this actually a story mode? Oh my god! What the fuck is that? Oh my god! Is that? No! Is that the nigga from? We'll no, that's need to take down about ten. Stow your fear. It's now or never. We'll win this. I Boys, know we will. This looks so serious. Oh my god. Nigga, did Taboo come back? Everybody's about to die, bro. That nigga Taboo's back, bro. Wow, it's fucking killing everybody! Wow! Falcon couldn't even escape! Wow. They. The fucking Inklings! Everybody's getting caught. 
Oh, and they can't fly if she can. Oh, damn, nigga. Everybody's getting blown away. Why is Sakurai killing all the characters? Everyone's officially dead now. Everyone's dead. He killed everybody. Only Kirby's living, of course. Of fucking course. The whole world got fucking blown back. Nigga, Sakurai pulled off Thanos. He pulled off Thanos. He pulled off Thanos. Dog, I, well, everyone's dead. Everybody's dead. There's a, there's a, there's a fucking theme song? It's just Kirby? On that day, when the sky fell away, our world came to an end. Is that the Kingdom Hearts chick? What is happening? Is this what is this what the theme of Smash? I feel like this is, is this like everyone caught in the struggle and then the storms of change they fan the flame scattering gas All these niggas are fucking woke right now I don't know about this mode though bro I mean Is this like the story mode No escape no greater fate to be made It's like a platform Shant, oh, you got me excited, bro. But DLC is coming. Played as And what the fuck is that? Super Smash Ultimate World of Light. Is this like the full thing? Is that the full title of the game? The World of Light, bro. That was a fucking story mode right there. Shit, all right, you know what, man? That was dope. I'm about to be out of here, though, because I gotta upload these clips to, to Twitter. <laughs> so I'll see you dudes later on. That was amazing. Bro, there's so many fucking details that were revealed there, and I'm not really sad about they're not being the characters that we want because you know they, they can always be added later on five slots for dlc coming up um pd piranha is one of them so i guess that means four left unless he's not counted in the group or whatever but anyways i'll see you dudes later on thank you for tuning in wherever the fuck you found this video and i'll see you in the next one take care of yourself and of course as usual please have yourself a damn good one i'm out